Hey there YouTube, it's TJ, and today we're going to be talking some cool behind the scenes facts of some of our most popular videos. So this video, our cousin TJ is counting $10,000 in hundo dollar bills, and as you could see, that's some real beautiful blue bills. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of wonderful, uh, cool little features on these hundo dollar bills that we can talk about later, but you know, people always ask us, Dave, TJ, TJ, where do you get your money? And, you know, people want to know where they could get their own money. So I'm going to lead you to a little secret of where our money comes from. And so our money comes from the United States Mint. And the United States Mint is a service of the United States federal government that prints money and, and also makes coins and also makes bullion, which is like pure pure cool like shiny metals that pirates used to bite back in the day before there were things like cookies and oreos and so our dollar bills come from a variety of sources um, so it can come from the san francisco california u.s mint it could come from the denver colorado aka the mile high money maker uh, a u.s mint organization out there it could come from west point new york which is uh you know where the the army guys learn how to shoot and uh, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, where, you know what, Benjamin Franklin, whose old mug is on those money, is from. And also Washington, D.C., you know, yada yada, U.S. government. Uh, and then Fort Knox, Kentucky. But that's where all the solid gold and the solid silver and palladium and all, all, all the fancy stuff that we're not counting in our videos comes from. So uh, they could just, you know, go kick a rock down the street for all I care. Um, but what's really special about these twenty thirteen hundred dollar notes that our cousin TJ is flopping down on the money uh, on the money mat is it has a real signature series of characteristics. So these dollar bills have an interesting feel to it. They have raised printing, and so raised printing is a way to combat counterfeiters or you know arts and crafters who are just trying to make their own money. And you know, not trying to get arrested, but you know, somehow get involved in it. Um, there's security ribbon, which offers 3D imagery. Uh, there's some color shifting uh, little features, including the the bell in the inkwell. And so, as we were talking about before, you know, Benjamin Franklin, the guy who died of syphilis, uh, lived in Philadelphia, and so there's a little Liberty Bell right there. Um, and also there's some security thread, ultraviolet security threads, watermarks of Benji Franklin's face on the right hand side, right underneath the first top right hundo. And also there's microprinting, which means little words and stuff like that down in there. So I hope you learned something today. If not, well, keep on watching our videos, like, and subscribe. And don't forget, buy our NFTs. Buy our NFTs.